Hi, this is BCIG Online. I'm Andy White, and we're here today with Amlaku um, Bix Eshti. Um, Amlaku, yeah. you won a scholarship to attend BCIG uh, two years ago yes. in Bonn. Yes. Right. Um, can you tell us a little bit about that process? What What do you actually have to do to apply for a scholarship? Um, <coughs> thank you. Uh, the, uh, to start with, uh, I was not uh, a business English teacher, uh, I was uh, teaching English uh, for academic purpose uh, at a university, mm -hmm. but uh, I had subscribed the British Council English Language Electronics Scheme, uh, mm -hmm. I think English Language, LTEX, okay. you know, the British Council LTEX, and I, uh, I received the announcement through that uh, uh, contact scheme, okay. uh, and then I applied. Um, and I have to improve my, I mean, write again and uh, apply for the second time. Mm -hmm. And then I, I received that, the news that I, uh, I won the scholarship. Okay, what does that mean when you win the scholarship? What, what does BSIG do for you? Um, <coughs> the first thing is attending the conference. Right. And uh, as a result, I, I became a member to IITFU and BASIC. Mm -hmm. uh, which which continued up to now and uh, uh, later it was in 2009 I, uh, I again applied for white WSM wide scheme membership mm -hmm. uh, and I won that again okay for two years so uh -huh. uh, the first year I paid for the membership mm -hmm. and uh, for the uh, up to 2012 uh, I got that white scheme scholarship uh, membership, okay. Membership scholarship, and uh, that is uh, the other benefit I got from from uh, basic uh, and participating in such a uh, a big uh, international conference was my first time, mm -hmm. uh, and I found it very exciting. What was the What was the best thing that you took away from that? What did you learn? Um, well. One is just to refresh the, the, uh, what uh, and learn f different things from uh, different people mm. uh, professionally, mm -hmm. and the other I took uh, some materials uh, from here, uh, some of them from uh, the uh, exhibition yeah. the publishers I right. took away, and uh, through. As uh, a result of um, uh, my contacts I established here, uh, I was I have been able to receive many books from yourself, Andy. Yeah. yeah. And uh, although I have not used them as as my wish to use them, mm -hmm. uh, I'm, I've been using some of them for my teaching. Yeah, and, fabulous. Uh, it was great, and second time I'm I'm now here. Mm -hmm. Um, when you win a scholarship, um, mm -hmm. you need to give a presentation at BSIG, is that correct? Uh, the requirement was uh, not a presentation, but a presentation because I, I was able to, I had one, mm -hmm. uh, which I would like, uh, I, I liked to present, uh, I was able to present. But as a requirement for the scholarship was uh, writing a report, a diary, okay. com a conference diary letter. Mm -hmm. And I, I, that was the requirement. Okay. And I um, agreed to to be to, to write a conference diary, and uh, it was after the conference. And I just took uh, some notes from the, the, the uh, some notes about the the sessions I attended, mm -hmm. and some uh, my impressions generally about the conference. And later, when I went back, I compiled and uh, sent to. Uh, basic um, uh, newsletter editor, mm -hmm. and it was uh, published in the newsletter. Okay, excellent. And uh, that was a requirement for all scholarship winners. Yeah, we were five in two thousand eight from different geographical locations. Yeah, and I was the only African participating in the conference. Right, I, th I think it's um, it's probably one of the best things about the conference. I think is. Mm -hmm. um, that BSIG supports people in other places and this pulling together and as you mentioned yes. the networking, the contacts you make exactly. yeah, mm. and then bringing all that home mm. and, and doing something with it. Especially yeah. for uh, teachers, English language teachers uh, uh, like in Ethiopia. Yeah. Uh, there are non, 
are such refreshing courses and seminars. It, the teachers are left alone f uh, with with old cl uh, teaching materials and uh, with with just classrooms and students. And yeah. it's up to the teacher to to promote himself and or herself and uh, bring new things to to his or her students. Yeah. So uh, for me, it is fantastic and um, uh, exciting because I'm able to uh, learn so many things from the international community and compare the situation what is in Ethiopia and uh, today I was attending uh, Peter Sharma's session which is about uh, technologies, uh, business English materials and technologies in business uh, English teaching and I was, I was wondering where we are and where th the world is and yeah. it's interesting to at least see that. Yeah, I think it, it's always something I have in my head as well, mm. uh, what what the situations of teaching are in other places of, of in the world, mm. um, yeah, what we can use, what we can do. Um, okay, yeah, <laughs> I'm going to steal you, you're coming to Hamburg with me, and we're going to share some things with the teachers there. Uh, um, um, sure. yeah. yeah, and uh, I have to say for me, this is a, a special interview because we've had um, contact online for two years and, and proposed and uh, things like that so I get mm. to meet you in person and today's the first time and uh, I'm looking forward to having you as a guest in Hamburg. Oh, thank you very yeah, much. So we get to have um, lots, lots more chats very soon. Yeah, but you, you, you can imagine how interesting it is. Uh, English, we're teaching one language, English. Mm. It is taught everywhere else in the world you can't imagine how differently it is taught yeah. <laughs> in different countries and yeah. that's really many things uh, it means many things to me and yeah. uh, it enrich, enriches me professionally and uh, widens the, the, my understanding of I agree English. totally <laughs> yeah all right okay well um, we're gonna stop there and get back to the conference I have to say thank you very much for the chat. Thank you. And I hope you have a fabulous time. I'm sure you will. Thank you. Too. All right. Thank you very Thanks much. Thanks for watching.